Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Darkness Falls series. So it's the morning of day 51 and I done a bunch of organizing last night. Got all the old boxes taken out. So in here we've got our medical supplies. In here we have stuff that we need to cook into things. Here we've got all the finished food and all the finished stuff, which we should probably go ahead and use a few of these right now because we're, we're hurting right now as far as food and water goes. Take another one of these. Um, so the clay bowls can go back in there. And then over here we've got all our building materials and electronic stuff set in there. The next one over is all of the stuff we need to turn into ammunition in that. This one here is all of our guns and equipment and other stuffs. I want to grab these guys out today because we're going to be wearing those. Uh, let's grab um, you and you. Maybe you. I don't know if we'll be able to fit some stuff in there, but we'll be able to put some stuff on our clothing. Then in here, we've got all of our building materials and stuff, our gun stuff. It's not perfect, but it's set up for now. Uh, i got to paint it all later. In here, we have everything we want to sell to the trader, which we're going to do today. But first things first, let's go ahead and get in here. Oh, actually, put these away. What I want to do first things first. Not really first thing, because it's partway through the morning. I'm going to go over here. And grab our mastery book. All right. There it is, folks. So that gives us... We've got five skill points, too. Uh, it gives us... Master Security Class, the ability to make military armor, increasing uh, crafting ten uh, by 10 for automatic weapons, which means I think the, uh, the M4A1 should go up one more. I think if we make another M4, it should be at level 80 now. No, it's still 71. Interesting. That's not considered automatic weapon? Maybe it's negated because of, it could be. It might be negated because it's, um, yeah. Um, it's applied by the security class or not uh, the survivalist class, I mean. It could be gated. All right, let's pull these off. Let's pull you out, modify you. And we'll put this helmet on here. Put the advanced muffle connectors in there. Put you in there. Put you in there. Put the armor plate in there. Sure. Where are you? And then we can modify you. I don't think we'll be able to get much in there. And modify you. You, you, and you, and you. Nice. Wear that. We might as well sell these two. Not going to need them anymore. And we'll put the military armor back in here just so that we can use it to repair our stuff with, which is why I'm keeping all these. At some point, we'll be able to combine them and make higher tiers, but just not right now. Okay, that's done. Um, so what are we going to do now? Um, we should probably, I mean, I should go out and do that clear out there, but I really think we need to work on the base today. Uh, we got to figure out our power situation. I got the doors put in last night. I got that door put in. It doesn't open, obviously. Uh, I need stone. Grab you. Grab some of you. Grab you. Because we made some sand here last or yesterday. Got a little bit of concrete, but not much. Uh, so we can make... Oh, a lot more than that. We can make 3,500, so 1,800 here, and the rest in there. Get that working. We'll worry about base repairs later. We need a motion sensor, so let's get that built first. Uh, where do we build that? Here? So if it's... Two, one, five. It's the same. Two, one, and five. Let's make a few of them. Uh, you. 
you. Man, we're ahead on some things and behind. It's like so far behind on others. Let's take some of that out. Uh, what was I looking for? Oh yeah, forge iron. I want to go ahead. I gotta go down to that mine and do some more mining. Damn it. Keep the steel going if we can. Okay, let's make four motion sensors. Get that started. Okay, um, so I'm gonna need the wire tool. Probably gonna need a relay. Or switch. Ah, uh, crap. Because the motion sensor door, how do we keep it open at night? I may have made a big mistake. How do we keep a motion sensor door open at night? Is there a way to set it so that it's always open? Well, we'll have to power it up and find out. Do we have any relays here? Doesn't look like it, so I'll have to make some relays, I guess. Uh, I think it's mechanical, electrical, and forged iron again. Uh, relay. Do them over here. Get those going. Grab the motion sensors. So. I should probably put one motion sensor on the inside and then one on the outside. But we have to wire it to something that's going to be turned on all the time. Which means... I wonder why that switch doesn't work. Because that's wired from there. To, wait, is that? So this one goes to... This one goes to the far... Uh, our old... Um, Yeah, that goes to the old wires. Let's rewire everything. Let's just do it. Take you out of there. That'll reset everything. Let's take you out of there. That'll reset everything. All right, now we gotta rewire everything. Somehow the wires still look like they're there. Talk about glitching, eh? Uh, do we put a generator in here? That we can just turn on and have all of the horde stuff on at once in here. Because we're none of this is ever getting hit, right? I mean, it might at some point, but it's not right now. So, if we knock out this guy... Then we can put the generator bank here for now, one of them. Then we can go ahead, we'll put a plate in here, I think, to protect it. So we wire up you to there. Then we need to get to the roof, so let's get a couple of... Oh, we got frames right here. A couple of frames, so we put a frame there, there, and that gets us to the roof. So then we wire up from this to there. So that provides power for the first set. And then from there to there. Oh, why is that? 
reversed. That's interesting. Not reach that from here? God damn it. Okay, do this. And that. So we can get down there and hook it up. So we should be able to go from you. I wonder if we only had one of our wires working the other night. Two. Where's the second guy? Am I at, oh, I'm at red. Damn it. Come on. Don't make me knock out a block. Shit. Did not mean to do that. Yeah, right, we gotta redo it. So if I can get to, let's say, here, I can kind of see it from there. All right, well, oh wait, we got to go from upstairs. There's got to be an easier way to do this, and I'm sure there is, but you know me. Shoot. Really? Maybe from there? That just seems a little chintzy to me. I think I gotta knock that block out. It's like right there. Why is this closed all of a sudden? It's like right there. There we go. Got it. Oh, nice. Excellent. Let's not uh, lose our frames here. Okay, so we got to rewire all this. It's just to the power to these plates, which should be from up there. Right? So that's these guys set up. Let's back to the door. Okay. So that's powered from the switch here. Now let's get another switch. Oh, uh, we gotta... Alright, we're gonna power the front door from inside. Or from somewhere else, but not from here. Put three of those in. Pull it up. Uh, so that's off, so I should be able to walk through here. Okay, beautiful. Uh, so let's hook up you to the turret. Nice. And it cooked off a crap ton of ammo again last night. It's like seeing right through here. Like right through there. I have to take these blocks out to do it properly. Or I have to realign this guy. Oh, power's off? Of course, I'm going to get electrocuted uh, trying to get back up here. Because why wouldn't I? Let's go this way. Put you there. Turn that on. Okay, now we realign this guy a bit. So it was seeing between the cracks there. Is 
So let's just do it this way. It's not the best, but at least it'll cover this. Yeah, because it was even hitting these too, right? For a little bit of damage. Okay, turn this off. So that's that done. That's all hooked up to the inside. Now we want to do the the plate traps from here as well, I think. But where? Like, do we want to run another switch here? Let's see if it reaches. That's uh, that's the question. I don't even know if it's going to reach, right? We had issues before, so let's go from you to you. And from you to you. There we go. Those power the uh, turrets. Looks like hell. But, yeah, because then that power goes to those, and then those go to the turrets, or the uh, dart traps. Dart traps fire off. Good stuff. All fine and dandy. We can turn them on and off with this. Beautiful. So that, I feel better about that. Now, for the front doors... Let's get some gas. We don't need a lot for that. We just need motion sensors. But there's got to be a way to leave... The door open. Uh, let's grab a relay. I don't know if I'm going to need a relay. Let's grab some anyway. Maybe we put it underground. Let's grab some rebar. Um, might as well do some basic repairs over there too. Uh, where's the rebar? Here it is. Don't need a lot. How much do we got here? That was a wandering horde. That's a wandering horde. Somebody's banging on something. Well, it's back door here. Ah, shit. Alright, well, whatever. Guys, what are you shooting at? Oh. Shooting at my car, apparently. Alright, we gotta go back in this way. Oop, we might as well just do... Since we're, since we're here, grab this. Let's not do it that way. Let's do it this way. Since I said I was going to do it this way. Can upgrade the blocks here. While this is open. And I did say oh, quite a while back that I was going to do it this way. Nice. Yeah, they, I think that was the, the, that one cop was like hammering on these for some reason. Oh, that was just wonderful. That was a bad piece of rebar anyway. I had to get rid of that. Okay, now let's get the power for the front door here. We're going to dig down a little bit right here. Like, eventually I wanted to make all this uh, rebar anyway, so... Or, uh, you know what I mean, concrete. Do that, that, that. And then we do... One, two, three, four. And then we dig this out. Five. 
We're gonna make a, um... Oh, I hear you out there. Ooh. Kids printing off some school stuff. So, um... We're gonna put a steel hatch in here. And this is where the power will be. Where is he? Oh, there you are. Just the two dogs? Just the two dogs. All right. Uh, let's go back and put in yonder door. So this one we need to switch around so it's going to open inwards. And then we need to go and put our power here. Then we can run... Actually, we need this to be... there. It's going to be annoying because anytime we run by this, it's going to like open to that from there to there. Right? And then we can go ahead and power this with you. And let's refuel the hell out of this. There we go. So that's going to work. Get you pointed like right down. Like that. Hey, you. That's actually perfect. Oh, okay, we gotta figure out how long it's gonna open for, though. So, is that a function of this? I think it's a function of this. Okay, powered instance, powered duration. Two seconds? Three seconds, probably. That's perfect. Alright, now we put one of these guys out here. Like that. Right? Uh... Okay, um, I guess we're climbing back over because got no way in. And then we go ahead and we hook up you. To you. And you to you. And then we can go ahead and angle this guy. straight down like so now I should be able to put if I put it on always that should open and stay open the whole time Right? It'll just sit there. It'll stay open. Because then what we can do is once we go in Wait. So that just means it opens and stays open. So if we go Back to three seconds here. Yeah, so we can just switch it on Horde Knight then. That's perfect. We'll switch it on Horde Knight. Because now we can just run in and it'll close. Hey. What do I do wrong here? Oh, you're not hooked up to the door anymore.
Do I have to loop it through the cameras? Of course. Okay, so... That does it. So I do have to loop it through the cameras. Yeah. That's perfect. Okay, let's go make that hatch. So that door is done. Oh, it took a minute to figure that out, but we got it. All right. Um, so we need to make a hatch with our gear over here. I got to get this stuff painted too, or I'm not going to be able to recognize what the hell I need to recognize stuff as. We need mechanical parts. Oh, we don't need mechanical parts. We just need springs. I think we just need two springs. Start with an S. Nope. In here. Bolt hatch. Craft. All right. We'll get that going. Now what do we got to do? Uh, what do we have going on in here? The other, the other motion sensor. Don't need right now. Okay, so... Um, yeah, let's get the base repairs done. We've got a lot of repair work to do. Okay, so this first level of this hatch was almost gone. So they had two more levels of hatch, which is good. And then this barely took any damage. How much damage did this take? A little bit. I think it's partially because I was shooting at it too. This ramp barely took anything. You're still at 100%. Yeah, pretty darn good all the way along here. Like, almost no damage at all. That's what I like, man. Low maintenance spaces are the best. Now do we have, we don't, I didn't bring out my mechanical electrical parts. So these barely took any damage either. And that was partially from me shooting them, I think. Because I was shooting down here a fair bit. Okay, so the stairs took a minor amount of damage. And it looks like this took a minor amount of damage too. Like, really nothing. Like, I probably didn't even need to fix this. I could just leave it. But I'm not going to do that. I want to make sure it's maxed out. So they barely did any damage to the spikes here. Which, which means that the spikes did barely any damage to them. Although... I'm thinking about taking them out, but I don't think we do that. I think we need to leave them in. I think they have to stay there. Okay, so they didn't attack the building at all. We had the one guy banging over here, but that was it. Wasn't really doing anything. Okay, let's get this goop cleaned up. So down here, once again we had guys banging down here. But really doing nothing. Yeah, like zero or really damaged here. This pillar is perfectly intact. All right, they broke through the steel here. But other than that, it was little damage. I don't know if it was people banging. Probably people banging on stuff down here. Minor amounts of damage along there. So the dart traps... Okay, I just want to see how much ammo they use. So they were... I don't think those guys really used any ammo, did they? Is it a problem with the wiring? I 
Uh, that could be the case. It may very well be the case that I made an error with the uh, wiring here. Uh, let's put another half a stack in there. Another half a stack in this guy. Because they're firing more often than these ones are. If these ones are firing at all. Like, I don't even know. Oh, use up all the ammo already. Did I really? Alright, I don't know. I don't know what to say. Yeah, minor amounts of damage. Pretty much everywhere. Where was that? There was that one block. There was another block I saw here that needed some repair. Between here? No. Oh, wait. There's a block here somewhere that needed some repair. Oh, where? How? I, I don't even know what blocks they are. Am I seeing underneath this? Or is it just I need to be right on top of it to fix it? That's weird. There's the crickets. Man, these days are so short now. The days are so short. Well, sorry guys, this is such a boring episode, but this stuff needs to be done or else we're going to die on Horde Night. Yeah, it's like I gotta target the center of the block or something, or else it's not gonna repair. It's so weird. It's like I'm targeting myself or something. Like, you can see my name pop up. I'm targeting myself somehow. I don't know how that is. Don't know how that works, but whatever. Okay, that's that updated. Let's get upstairs. Oh, we got a little bit of work to do here on the steps. Did that. Yeah, pretty good. Yeah, I'm getting these weird targeting boxes. I don't understand why it's targeting me and not... Uh, That. That's so weird. All right, I think we need to upgrade these because we are shooting these a fair bit. Oops, we just lost that. Okay, let's put these guys back in. Let's just do it this way, though. Makes it easier. Don't lose any that way. Yeah, so almost no damage on the front here. Like a handful of... A handful of damage on each of these blocks, but really nothing that's significant, you know? Oh, the second hatch took a bunch of damage. But I think that was partially from me. Alright, we out of, we out of steel. We are out of steel right now. So we got a bit more work to do. Uh, let's go ahead and put in... Take you out, put you down. And shape. Plate. Is that considered a face? That is not considered a face. Alright. Alright, we do it the hard way. Well, not that hard, I guess. That should at least help protect the generator bank from being hit. Although I probably should apply it... ...there as well. I don't like... This one is pretty covered from the door. There's like almost... Almost no chance of this one being hit. But th those guys there... Like if a cop comes up here and spits... There's a chance he could hit these. So at least with this up... 
It's gonna protect them. Kind of. Okay, so let's get inside. That's a bunch of work done out there. Feels pretty good to get that stuff done. Let's put this stuff away. Wiring's pretty good too. I feel a lot better about at least having half decent wiring. So okay, put you guys in there. Come on, both of you. All right, now, uh, what else did I want to do today? Oh, we need the lights for in here too. I need another generator. I don't have one generator. Actually, no, I know what I wanted to do. Take all that. And take this and go visit the trader. Now, we got some stuff in here. I gotta take the dyes off this time. If there's any dye left here, I took a bunch of them off. That we can scrap. We didn't have as much hazmat fiber as I thought we had. So, scrap that. Brown dye can go in here. So, let's go talk to Jen. Actually, what do you have for a quest today? Anything good? Clear zombies to the north. Is that the library again? Help me with a little Modern house. You the man. Sure. Worry about that tomorrow. Uh, let's go talk to Jen. I think the next project is taking this out. Shouldn't be too hard. We drop. We take these two out down here, and then break those up. Oh, this actually might come down if I take those two out. If it does, great. If it doesn't, well. We figure it out, because this is a nightmare. If they get up on the walls, they're going to come straight up into there. They've already I done it, so... to close up for the night. Were you? But I guess I'll make time for one more customer. Good, because I got some stuff to sell you. I know you restocked, so... Let's get this sold. All right, well, that's a bunch of stuff sold, and I went ahead and did a, a boo-boo. I sold the foregrip bod, bod by mistake, so I got to buy, buy it back. That was dumb of me. Oh, God. Okay, the 20 schematics. Actually, do you have awesome sauce? No, you don't. All right, I was just hoping I could buy these cheap, but I... Not going to be able to do that, unfortunately. That's fine. Going to buy your 9 mil so I don't have to make it. Your AP ammo so I don't have to make it. Some more 762 so I don't have to make it. Uh, what else do we have here that's important? Anything good? Regular SMG turrets. No thanks. I'm burning through ammo like crazy. I can't afford to keep putting SMG turrets up. Those steel turrets need to be put in a position that are only going to target the... Uh, the big flyers, I think. Okay, more gunpowder. Uh, more clay. Ooh, more lead. Saves me having to go out and mine the damn stuff. Speaking of mining, I need to go down to the mine tonight and get stone and iron. Where are we at here? Down here. Okay, AP ammo. Let's go buy your shotgun rounds. We got lots left over. AP 9mm, bullet tips. That's all the stuff I sold you. Okay, I mean... We made it okay. Got a little bit of stuff. Still got lots of money. Any ammo left in here that we wanted to buy? No? Forged iron is relatively cheap. Yeah, 285. We might as well buy your forged iron. Do you have any here? 1900? Sure. Saves time making it. Um, excuse me, no steel, eh? What about duct tape? Brass? We got plenty of casings, but it's always nice to have plenty more. I think that's thanks good. For the business. Yeah, thanks for being here. We're open from dawn to dusk. I'm glad you're still alive. You know, you know, uh, scrap this. Okay, and that will be it. I am going to end the episode here, guys, because I'm heading down to the mine. Uh, once we go in here to do some crazy shiz, gonna go mine some iron. 
mine a whole bunch of stone. Um, yeah, and then tomorrow when we come back, we're going to go and do a couple of quests. Because uh, I want to get a couple more quests knocked out for the trader. And then um, we'll figure out where we're going from there. But until next time, um, yeah, we'll see you later. <laughs>